got this uh, engine cage finally all ready to put back in this Chevy. I'm just getting ready. Going to start working on that today, actually. I'm um, just kind of finished up those last lower uh, removable pieces for these tubes. Um, you can see they've all got uh, some Allen screws in them with some uh, nuts on the bottom. Capture nuts that... That is so when uh, this is in the truck, then obviously you'd be able to remove the engine. If you ever need to remove the engine out of this thing, um, you'll still be able to get it up and out with a uh, cherry picker. So now that I've got all that done, this is as much stuff as I could get done um, kind of out of the truck. I want to weld as much as possible, not in the truck. Um, but now I'm going to put it back in. I, I've gotten all this stuff welded, all the shock mounts, all of the um, connectors, the tube connectors. And then just everything else, all the tubes and all the stuff is welded. And we'll put it back in the truck. And then there's going to end up being some uh, tie-ins that will come off the here and then off the bottom of this corner and down to the frame. Um, right about where that bump stop is, right up in there actually. So I'll probably get into a lot more of that in the next video on this thing that I'm going to put out. And that'll be kind of what I'm working on next is getting it installed and starting to put all the runners in and then getting back to pretty much some of the cage stuff. I got a bunch more of the cage um, pieces that go into the cage and tying this thing all to the frame and then getting pretty much everything welded into the frame. So that's kind of the mission that I'm on with this thing right now is getting all the last pieces fully welded up and getting them in the truck, making sure everything cycles clean, getting the thing on weight and uh getting this thing ready to start test driving and tuning shocks and all that stuff once dunes open up in april so that is kind of the goal of this have this thing out um pretty early in the spring and get some testing on it so yeah next video we'll be putting that thing in for now i think we'll then show the next project that we're working on is this thing here if you noticed in the video i have uh someone else in the shop helping me now so they're working on some stuff while I'm working on uh, some stuff. And yeah, you'll probably see them in, him in more videos. Um, but he ended up getting the front of this truck all tore apart. We've got the A-arms off of it. Fenders came off. Um, bumper, grilled, you know, everything. But we're all the way even down to the rack and the steering rack is off. The um, front diff is out of it. Uh, we've got all the wiring and stuff labeled. And most of the wiring and everything is all still in it. But... Most everything that was um, removable with bolts is out. Now it's to a point, um, the weather's getting pretty good around here. So the other day it was 60 and had the shop open. Probably the uh, next nice warm day, we're in a spout of rain right now, but next warm day we get, I'll probably have uh, my help start working on cutting these mounts off, all the stuff that's factory welded onto the frame. These are coming off, this is coming off. And then this truck, it does have, uh, some surface rust on the frame. We're gonna have to get rid of all of that. So some flap wheels, a um, lot of dust, a lot of grinding. Um, not the funnest part of, you know, building um, trucks, but we got to get it to that point. Um, sometimes they start like that. So I think this side of the frame is a little cleaner. Um, if you see, there's still some black paint, but we still got to come in here and even like front of these things get cut off. Um, yeah, that's kind of where this truck is at. This thing's been in the shop for a little bit, but we've got uh, some progress started on it. And I think I have showed in a video before, I do have a full beam kit cut out already for it. Um, I do still need knuckles and swingers cut out, but kind of slowly progressing on this. And um, yeah, you kind of got some of the first taste. It's kind of cool. Finally, we got it on jack stands, got the front end ripped out of it and progress is happening on that. So. If you're uh, watching my stuff, thanks for watching. We're going to get busy uh, right after I've got posted this video. We're starting right in on this, getting this put in today. So I'm um, hoping to have another video out soon. And uh, dune season is getting here close. We've got a lot of shock stuff. I think I'm going to do a shock video here soon too. So thanks for watching. Peace.